What did you do? You hit your knee on something there, I see. My kneecap. Yeah, that's normal. To have a big, huge piece of equipment, so when you, you slide your chair in every time, you got to fucking... Uh, it is here. I think I just split it in half. Anyway, Bob, Bill Burr was saying that he had a... Oh, wait a minute. I don't know if I'm supposed to say this on the air. Huh? Had what? Hold on. Uh oh, he's writing something down. Oh, I don't no, blow. he was nah, no, because nah. he started yeah, yeah, out yeah, of his yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why I wrote Jesus. it down. Jesus, <laughs> <laughs> exactly. You don't remember me saying is the mic off? Well, that's why I fucking wrote it down because then I wasn't sure. Oh, okay. I don't blow up spots anymore. Oh, okay, I'm, I'm being a little smarter. <laughs> it's a great story though. <laughs> Oh, that's no, no, awkward for everybody. Yeah. Right. It's not uh, as good as this YouTube video. There yeah, thank go. you, Bill. There we go. Bill Burr was telling us that he found a fine video clip called Best, uh, Best wrestling, wrestling Promo, promo ever. ever, starring uh, this guy, Jumpin' Jeff Farmer. I'm judging, I'm guessing that it's, it's from like the 80s, and this is before Vince McMahon sewed everything up, so it's an independent uh, wrestling thing. I don't know. I don't know where at. But this guy is. This uh, is legit. So basically, what it is is this guy jumping Jeff Farmer. He's gonna, you know he's going to promote jumping his show. Jumping Jeff Farmer. Jumping Jeff Farmer. He's going to promote his big wrestling match coming up on the Saturday. He's going to do the Ric Flair thing. Now well, let me tell been, you something. He's supposed to be doing that shit, and he, he it might have a little bit a uh, little bit of a tough tough time. We, we've all been spoiled by the uh, professionalness of the wrestlers and uh, how how they're able to rock the mic and really get on there and ad lib and talk. And uh, this guy apparently doesn't have the skills. He's still in, in the development phase. I'm oh, not, okay. not going to judge his entire career. But. All right. Should we get Sam in here? He's a wrestling expert. Sam I, is I, I an expert. Maybe I mean, uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Sam. Uh, uh, will really come running down the hall with those floppy feet. You know, we've we got to promote that Kevin Smith's calling the show today, too. Oh, yeah. show just keeps getting better and better. Oh, my God. He tweeted a while ago that he's, he's sleeping on his phone. Right yeah. now, so so they wake him up for the uh, the interview today. So uh, Kevin Smith in about fifteen twenty minutes. Very All cool. right, let's check this out. Best wrestling promo ever. Earlier we talked to Jumpin' Jeff Farmer. Let's go now to that interview, folks. There's Jumpin' Jeff Farmer. Jeff, a while back, what a match you had with Motley. Yep. Probably the hardest match I ever All had right, in my life. Pause. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like it when things aren't my, going my way. Motley Cruz, you turned the tables on me. You turned the tables in a wrong way. You got me mad now. I've stood around. I've listened to everything you had to say. I've did everything necessary. But when you turn around and you backstab me one way or another and you treat cheat me out of what's rightfully mine, that's when I get angry. Now I'm the one doing the challenging. I'm issuing a challenge to you, Motley Cruz. Get in the ring with me. This time, I'm going full force. <laughs> Jumping Jeff Farmer. Now let's go to the <laughs> Jumping <laughs> Jeff? That guy is the worst. That is the worst intro ever. Oh. You got your ass kicked last week. Yep. Yep. <laughs> yep. yep. Motley Cruz. I'm... <laughs> I just love the panic force. on his face. Like he looks like oh, he's gonna fuck. piss That's himself. That's what I was supposed to. I was supposed to go on with this shit. He looks like he's gonna piss himself. <laughs> what man? That guy Someone's saying he played the fake Sting at one point. Is that true, Sam? Really? Does he look so. familiar? I don't think so. He never had a career in wrestling, no, really. So. A, a Someone was trying to say he's in the Wrestling Hall of Fame. The the, the <laughs> W whatever the whatever that is. I'm in the WWE Hall of Fame. Well, he's in IPW. Don't I fucking mean, get IPW Sam so. started. He'll he'll school you yeah, on this Sam, shit. Sam, I thought you knew everybody. The, 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 the Did we find a wrestler you don't know? Now. I've stood around. I've listened to every. You know that guy? No, I didn't. No, you don't know that guy? What are you doing? Thing you had to say. I didn't know he was a Honda. I did everything yeah. necessary. Oh, give a listen. But when you turn around and you backstab me one way or another, and you treat cheat me out of what's rightfully mine, that's when I get angry. Now I'm the one doing the challenging. I'm issuing a challenge to you, Motley Cruz. Get in the ring with me. <laughs> this time, I'm going full force. Jumping Jeff Farmer. No, <laughs> that guy's <laughs> classic. That guy's classic too, by the way. <laughs> by the way, all wrestling promo bloopers are <laughs> it's <just> genius. Fucking <laughs> great. Kim Patera. <laughs> it, it's just fantastic. Are there some bloopers out there? Oh, yeah. Dude, have uh, you ever seen the one where Booker T calls Hulk Hogan the N word and then he <laughs> grabs his head because he's humiliated? Well, Hulk Hogan calls <laughs> yeah. Tony Atlas uh, Black Boy 
Like when he was doing, <laughs> really? back when he was uh, Thunder Lips. Uh, well, this one, this one's great. <laughs> the Hulk Hogan. Yeah. What's the tugboat one? Right here. We take what we want, and after we take Lex Luger and the Giants, we want the gold, sucker. Hulk Hogan, we coming for you, nigga. I should point out the record, Stevie Ray, look at this. Take a look. <laughs> Puts his hands up. Yeah. yeah it's the best is when he turns around and he looks at the girl and his crew like, oh, Vince is going to kill us. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we take what we want, and after we take Lex Luger and the Giants, we want the gold sucker. Hulk Hogan, we coming for you, nigga. I should point out the record. <laughs> 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 Sherry, Sherry was like, yeah. Yeah. what do you say? <laughs> <laughs> Which he should have been able to say, which is sound good. Oh, We're coming for you, nigga, because that's in his character. <laughs> uh, 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 fantastic. Wrestling promo bloopers right, are more. genius. Let's, let's well, Kip Patera is genius. Lex Luger's genius. There's a Lex Luger blooper right there. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Macho yeah. Man play, Luger. Let me play the Lex Luger one. We take what we want. <laughs> and after we take Lex Luger, and it's time. We want the gold, sucker. Hulk Hogan, we coming for you, nigga. I should play the record. The best part is he goes to cover his face and then he makes it look like he's rubbing his hands together. Yeah, he's like, like, uh, like he knows he fucked up so bad. Then he's thinking, maybe also, this will fly after all, so I gotta cover up that he just fucked the, up. The whole time he's got his chest, his pecs doing yeah, that. Yeah, his pecs are moving up and down. Yeah. <laughs> this one, this one's good because it's taken like when they do SmackDown, they tape it to rebroadcast and they edit it sometimes. Yeah. But if you have a satellite dish, you can pick up the satellite oh, the feed, feed and watch it live. Perfect. So they got the satellite feed of Hulk Hogan just completely like Fucking starting up. over and blowing it. Yeah. yeah. Like, okay. The Hulkster again. Oh, he messes up in front of the whole crowd. And you know, McMahon, the fact that I had something to do. With building this company just makes you sick. The fact that I am the one that put this company on the map and helped you make it what it is today, that makes you sick to your stomach, brother. Yeah. And all those Lear jets that you have, all those billions of dollars, the houses that your kids live in, the twenty million dollar vacation home and blah 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 blah. Shut up! Shut up! Because of these maniacs. Shut up! I can Vince. Kiss my ass. Whoa. <laughs> Fucking Vince. Let me tell you something. I think you're starting to believe in your own bullshit, Hogan. <laughs> <laughs> I could have had anybody play the part of Hulk Hogan. I could have had anybody bring Hulk a man. Hold on one second, McMahon. You actually think anybody could have ran with Hulk Mania? Look at all the guys you gave the ball to. Look at all the guys that had the belt. Look at all the guys that ran to the goal line. Nobody ran as hard and as long as I did, McMahon. <laughs> huh? It sounds like a real argument. I, I, I know. If actually. you actually think if you actually think I was just the right guy at the right place at the wrong at the right time, uh -oh. let me say it one more time <laughs> so you completely understand. <laughs> if you actually in believe in your mind, if you actually think that I was just the right gay guy <laughs> at the right place at right the right gay. time, well then you're a bigger delusional bastard than I thought you were, McMahon. Ooh. Right gay. <laughs> right gay. Yes. <laughs> Cockamania going wild. <laughs> you know what I say right now, McMahon? Right now we just settled this. They're waiting for somebody to yell cut. I had a match yeah, yeah, with yeah. The Rock a couple of weeks ago. Yeah, he was just babbling. And you were the one that I wanted to get in the ring. You were the one this that I was supposed stinks. to have a match really with. Does. Holy of mother of God. Ago, it goes on forever. And and you Sam. Sam, what Sam, happened? This is Why a, would you do a, this, Sam? This this a, I put the good ones on. Yeah, right. We're losing one. them, man. We got a good bit here. Right. Like, We're losing them. You go with a fucking yeah, four man. minute. Yeah, they really did mess up, didn't they? Yeah, yeah. What the fuck is. <laughs> Sounded like a regular promo to me. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, this is good. All right, let's go blue. Uh, he said this is good. You better make up with the. It's like Sluger. All right. And the Kempatero one, dude. Yeah, that, that one next. All right, Lex Luger. 
Mr. Luger, Mr. Luger, I saw what just happened out there with Ron Killens. I just want to ask you, I mean, what are your plans for the next show, Super Bowl Saturday? I mean, are you, are you going to take care of Ron Killens? What kind of disgusting, despic despicable lack of respect does that Billy What's-His-Name show book at a match for the total package of Lex Luger and Super Brawl? Super Saturday? What is it? I don't even know what it's called. What's it called? Super Brawl Saturday. Super Brawl Saturday? <laughs> Can you afford to pay me to wrestle run? I don't know. I'm one of the biggest legend stars ever in this. God! <laughs> he can't get and his you shirt off. Too, Billy! And you book a match with me against Ryan Killings! Look at me! I'm a total package! I will rip him apart! I'm pissed now! <laughs> he fucked that up. Oh! I don't think I... That stunk royally. Even the interviewer, he has his whole costume on, but his voice is just regular. Yeah, yeah. regular voice. Come to the point. What's that? What's that one, Sam? This one's Kim Patera with fucking Gene. The Intercontinental Title for less than 48 hours what? can Roddy be quite Roddy. so cocky, quite no, so. Er it. Has come to the point. Hey, that the conspiracy is completely it's really hard out of hand. Can hear. He turned his gang of henchmen on me. His goon squad: King Kong Bundy, King Harley <laughs> Race, Hercules Hernandez, Mr. Wonderful Paul Orndorff. Yeah, I've been humiliated before. If I'm so humiliated right now, I'm afraid to turn my back. I don't want the people to see what happened to me. They whipped me like a dirty yard dog. And I'm going to tell you something, Weasel, and the goon squad. I can take pain. I can recover it. Or recover. I can recuperate. Or oh, I'm fuck? beyond that. I am so... Watch Gene Ogle. Gene Ogle is the best. That are going on the world Gene. Gene. From your I think he was laughing when he said dirty yard dog. It's just a matter of time. Like I said before, and I said it to you, Mean Gene, I said it to everybody. It's just a matter of time when Ken Patera gets in full gear and runs the World Wrestling Federation, <laughs> the original World Wrestling Federation, of the likes of you, Weasel, and King Kong Bundy, Ray, Hercules, Orndorff, uh, all of you. You're all going to go down one by one, and I'm going to make sure of that. For the whipping that you gave me, whip me like a red-headed... Red -headed, <laughs> I'm sick and tired of that type of treatment. Look at Gene. Gene, Gene, Gene just starts cracking up. Whatever you guys want to do, just bring it on. He has his head around. Like I say, I'm going to carry these stars for a while, but I do hear, and I hear well. <laughs> All right, what a beating he took. Oh, that was a little too visual yeah, because oh, Mean Gene just laughing his Dude, fucking ass off. it's a shame. It, 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 this someone's been... Uh, oh, this is, this so, is really good. There's a couple things coming in. Uh, Botch Mania on YouTube and Shockmaster. Yeah, Shockmaster. 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 You've seen it before, I think. Shockmaster? Botch Mania is very visual. but uh, oh, okay. I this... had ten laughs in my life. <laughs> Shockmaster is up there? Shockmaster's yeah. in. Uh, it might ahead. be in the top five. Oh, we'll wow. Shockmaster. This is my favorite one. It's Psycho City. He doesn't realize he's live. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> the offense, but there are a lot of skeptics that think that perhaps you can't take it. How do you address those skeptics? Well, the skeptics and all the people have a little bit of... Let me do this again. Oh, it's live, pal. <laughs> it's live, pal. Get their answer tonight. Well, there you hear it, a man. A few words. Psycho said back to you, guys. <laughs> Ted DiBiase is like this idiot. <laughs> You're live, pal. He just asked, let me do that again. Yeah. Be, no. covered, be covered for him, though. A man, a few words. A few stubborn words. <laughs> yeah. This is uh, the Shockmaster. What it is was, the uh, Look, man. What's the setup on this? Basically, they is were this supposed to... Is this a good to... version of it? Oh, Ric Flair is the best. Yeah. They were supposed to... Uh, they had a mystery partner, and he was supposed to be like the next big uh, good guy in WCW. Yeah. And uh, he was supposed to bust through the wall, oh, no. but nobody told him there was a support two by four under, like at the base of the wall. Yeah. So he trips right over the two by four and falls flat on his face. <laughs> <laughs> this was... and, but you gotta have Sting. The, the entire thing. Is the funniest thing you ever seen? Sting and the bu and the B British Bulldog are horrendous. They were supposed to pick this big this big pump up of the yeah. Shockmaster. Yeah. Shock but when he fought, I'm telling when when Ric Flair, because he's one of the greatest of all time at this, surrounded by five bums <laughs> who are awful, and his reaction to what happens. I watched this 700 times, and, the shock, and I cry every time. The Shockmaster, he was just an old wrestler from the WWE. From, he was Tugboat 
in WWF. Uh, I remember talking except about Except they put a Stormtrooper helmet, <laughs> literally a Stormtrooper helmet oh. that they covered in glitter. Oh, with sparkles. <laughs> that was his outfit. Right, Make see. sure you have the, 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 the Sting lead in. I will. So that, this, you know. This was actually so bad that this guy had a whole gimmick. He was going to be the next main event guy. They changed his entire gimmick so that he was just a klutz that always lost. <laughs> they couldn't do anything with him. After that. Because of his debut, yeah. Yeah, and had to go get it and put it back on his head. <laughs> the helmet covers his whole face, so it's like that's his gimmick. His, you don't see it. It rolled away. And his helmet. <laughs> and <laughs> then rolled away. He had his head halfway through the wall, <laughs> trying to grab for his helmet. He had like a potted, glittered, potted plant on top of his fucking head. Do you think other wrestlers laughed at him for this? Oh, or his oh voice? God. Go his back, voice go was back. done. Go back. His voice was done by a guy oh. off the set who had a live mic. Oh, they didn't shit. tape it. He did it live. So when he trips, you can hear them go, oh, God, <laughs> off no. set. That was Rick Flair. Oh, Rick Flair. Rick when Rick five. Flair, he goes, because oh let me tell you something. The, the whole, if you, if you oh watch the whole God. thing when, at home, you got to understand the Harlem, Harlem Heat, yeah. who was just fucking a Hulk Hogan nigga, yes. he, had, he was doing a bad promo. And Sid Vicious, who we just saw again. Sid Vicious was doing a bad promo. Now, we just watched two bad promos. British Bulldog and Sting were awful, and Ric Flair had to, this was like the Ric Flair show. Yeah. So he was trying to put this together, and Ric Flair's trying to. But but when when he fell through the wall, Ric Flair went, "Oh God!" <laughs> <laughs> that fall through the wall is the greatest thing and I've it ever takes seen. Forever, it falls in slow motion. Oh, Did you rewind it? I rewind it even further. Oh, so yeah. that helmet falls. Uh, just how bad the promo is yeah. up to that point. He's man. panicked, grabbing for that helmet. And this is in front of an audience. Yo, Dude, yeah, it's, it's is... a live audience, and it's live on TV. <laughs> it's like, this is their big thing, leading uh, up to a pay per view, uh, oh live God. television by the pay per view, so uh, you can see this man. guy make you his debut. This, oh, that was supposed to be his debut. And he this is his, his debut. debut. This <laughs> is like this is the mystery and, 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 and to make you it perfectly can't. clear, they're expecting big things from the Shockman. The main event guy. Like maybe the next Hulk Hogan or something. Sting goes you in for a shot. All right. It completely changed. Yeah. For the most How part, is that, it ended that his career. helmet thing gonna stay on if he ever wrestles? If he wrestles, he doesn't they even need to about a strap or something. Is this yeah, the they, best clip? Of, the really audio is a little low this on this. This is the best uh, version of it. Yeah. All right. Bear it's with the us. Greatest thing I've ever seen. I yeah. rewound it a little further so you could get okay. something more lead up. All right. All right. This is Sid Vicious' bad promo. Yeah. You want me to tell you? You know they're all nervous because Flair's there. <laughs> Flair is just like disgusted. <laughs> oh my God! They're just yelling. <laughs> That's the British bulldog I'm talking about. Yeah. Shock the world because <laughs> he sure he is. is none other than the Shock Master! Right. Oh, God. Oh, God. I had him so good. Ah, <laughs> just go oh, stop it. Yeah. Yeah. Please go back to Flair. Wait, that is the worst outfit I've ever seen. <laughs> You it's have to he's, listen. He's got Captain he Caveman's it. vest on. It looks like he's wearing a pumpkin on his head. <laughs> he oh, away. Who the fuck? You <laughs> have to understand that Rick Flair <laughs> went, oh, he said, what the f- Oh, he was like, God. oh, God. Dude, he's oh, having his God. God. Goes <laughs> and he puts his helmet back on. <laughs> Aw awkward. He's shaking awkward. his head through his helmet. He's like, I fucked that up. He's got to put his helmet on because the other guy's going to do his promo for him. So you can't see his mouth. 
<laughs> Shock Master <laughs> Trip. <laughs> Just because it, it, it's like it's not even a regular wrestling <laughs> game, it's the shock master. He <laughs> falls, he falls through the wall. He's supposed to break through. I watched. I watched oh, this. Off. I watched this live in 1993. So it's the greatest moment in pro wrestling history. I'm There's never Bobby, been a better. If you, you think watch the entire thing, it. it's killing me. There's eight different things that'll make you laugh. Do you, think yeah. they, do you think they watch this and just laugh? Dude, oh, it yeah. his career, man. It did. It completely destroyed, it destroyed his, his career. career. It now, destroyed his career. Not only do you have to, you have to be as quiet as you can <laughs> because so you can hear Ric Flair say, "Oh God,", oh, God. and Listen. then. You can hear offset where he's supposed to, where he's getting ready to do his promo for him. Uh, you can hear them making fun of him. Okay. Oh, <laughs> just, 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 I, it's right. hard to. All right, let's try to be quiet. It is hard to be quiet because it's so it fucking funny. Just keep the laugh to yourself <laughs> if you can. His helmet. His helmet. Just rolls off. Just stinks. <laughs> <laughs> fucking fat gut of vets. This guy just, just sucks. Just yeah, no. <laughs> I fell. I fell through the wall. Yes. I was trying to drill a hole. I made it too big. <laughs> Wait a minute. You know what? And we're doing his costume of injustice. Yeah. He had a fur, a giant fur vest that was three quarter length, <laughs> with no buttons, a giant sparkly helmet, and jeans and boots. <laughs> the shock master and no shirt. Oh, the shock master. The shit. shock master was oh. an ass. <laughs> no, they Literally, after this show, they changed his entire gimmick. He became a construction worker that constantly falls down. <laughs> that was his career. Oh, they yes. gave him Bell's palsy. <laughs> <laughs> the stroke master <laughs> keeps having them. <laughs> Oh, okay. Shock master rules. I don't, I don't think I'm gonna be able to watch this. This again. is the greatest thing I've ever seen. I'm telling you, the dude. smoke. Okay, everybody, contain yourself. I will try. Uh, <laughs> we'll try. It looks like Big J. It's gonna be. All I have to say is, all I have to say is, our partner is going to shock the world because he is none other than the shock master. You hear my boy? Yeah. Now listen to the promo. <laughs> yes. His voice hasn't started yet. You see him. You see him He's motioning wrong. with He's his motioning. hands. Yeah. And his, but his voice didn't start yet. <laughs> the guy behind stage isn't talking yet. Right. So he's just motioning like he's talking, like he's a mime. But the worst is none of them said you fell through the wall, <laughs> yeah, right. Shockmaster. They're right. still acting like you're all. Dude, I'm yeah. actually impressed with this guy to be able to yell without laughing. Because Sid stinks. He sucks. Like, he's so bad. He probably didn't know. He, it's the... <laughs> with a he belt. has no muscles at all. He's terrible. <laughs> he's got a the muscle shock top. producer. <laughs> He's got on tight gap jeans. Yes. I have to have my stomach stapled. I keep breaking the wall and falling. I, just, I wish we could hear the audio better, but... Oh, yes. is that fucking I was funny. trying to nail a Foundry logo to the wall. I'll pummel you with how cupcakes are made DVDs. <laughs> And he got, he fell, and this is the thing too, if you, you see, you, he, he fell, no hands on his head, like, flat on his fucking, fucking stupid helmet, and his helmet went falling, he's gut down on the fucking floor like a fish. He fell Dude, like a guy with a sand pail on his head. Oh. <laughs> With no stopping himself. But dude, when he puts the helmet back on, I love the fact that as he's standing there, he has to wipe the ground dirt off his head. Yeah, like sheetrock <laughs> dust and ground dirt. And, and look, at staying his back. All I have to say is, he's calming everybody down. Here's the moment. All I have to say is, our partner's going to shock, shock the world. The world. That there guy it fucking... An explode, oh, it was an God. explosion. <laughs> yeah, yeah, big pyro. And, and the pyro was off timing. <laughs> it was wall. a disaster. It was a disaster. <laughs> <laughs> it was it's so bad. Right. Yeah. I got to see it again, done. please. Does We're he ready. ever get to uh, talk? Oh, yeah. Do you oh, want to hear him? Oh, yes. Why did he think this guy was going to... It's really hard to hear. The whole outfit, everything. Even he if does, it wasn't a mistake. Yeah, he doesn't have oh. a good body. That terrible helmet. Oh. Shock that stinks. All I have to say is, all I have to say uh -oh. is.
that is. His partner is going to shock the world because he is none other than. Wait, Steve stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. Stop it, I'm sorry. You got to understand, too. If you re This was Sid Vicious yeah. and the Harlem Heat. And they were beating up a uh, British bulldog and stink for like months. <laughs> right. And this is the guy that is going to match the intensity These are the of top, the three guys. The top bad guys in the company versus the top good guys. And they had no one with them. And they so need they someone, someone to someone. save the day. And this is the guy they fucking got <laughs> to stop the, the brutal onslaught that Holy they shit. enduring for the last month. And Do you, I would love to know what they're, what, what is the shockmaster thinking after after his helmet goes on, he's like, I just fell through the wall. <laughs> How humiliating is this? His big moment that he falls through the wall. Oh, oh I wish I could see that from behind him. Sam, Rick Flair's, oh, God. Yeah, it's oh. the best. Oh, uh, someone God. tweeted that they made fun of this on Raw recently. Yeah. Oh, you're, we get it with the clip. I get you the clip right here. <laughs> All right, good. Yeah, yeah. supposedly the, they went real inside and made fun of this <laughs> clip on Raw. The, it's less than a year time. ago. It's an yeah, less than a year, less than a year ago. All right, All right here's one more from the <laughs> Shockmaster. Yeah. Is going to shock the world because he is none other than the Shockmaster. <laughs> 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 Dude, he just fell. There's no two by four there. He just fell. <laughs> Everybody, man. <laughs> we got to let him Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. This is what he's doing. He's waiting for that guy to start talking. Yeah. And when he yells, he thinks it's his voice. <laughs> so he's actually yes. pantomiming the guy who's yelling at him. He thinks... That it's oh, his vo his uh, uh, backstage voice guy, but it's not. It's the guy that's yelling at him. And he can't even, he can't even pantomime. <laughs> the only... It's this five seconds, which seems like a million years, where everyone is collecting themselves <laughs> to pretend that shit did that. The audience, the Ric Flair, the Shockmaster... Everybody went, holy Dude, shit. His helmet's so discombobulated <laughs> that he thinks what he's hearing is what he's supposed to be saying. Dude, they're Dude, all... It, it, it literally is a, a, a stormtrooper helmet. He got that yes. at a Halloween yes. store. Yes, yes. yes. It's not an exaggeration. It's, it's the stormtrooper. Star stormtrooper helmet with glitter on it. And then he went to the next alley, he got the Captain Caveman yeah, yeah. fur vest yeah. and kept his jeans I, that he drove to the arena in. I think I heard a better version. From the guy that just tweeted me. Hey man, I, I gotta I a gotta pick version. up at nine forty five. Oh, I gotta shit. go to the airport. You gotta go, Bill. Yeah, I, Fuck. Yeah, I gotta fly Fuck. across. Bill Burke came by to say hi, uh, and we you appreciate that, Bill. Uh, yeah, he's going yeah, back to LA. Yeah, I, I will I will be back uh, next week. Yeah, next week. Hopefully, yeah. Oh, good. Ace, ASAP. Right. Anytime. We'll Bill They'll will be us. back on the show next week. All right, thank you, Mr. Burr. Keep up the podcast. I'm a big fan, Bill. The podcast. Take it easy, Bill. There goes Bill. The shot. They're all looking and going. The Shockmaster just fell. They all see the whole gig going down the toilet. Could you go back? Could you go to Shockmaster on Raw just see if it's a better clip? Shockmaster. On Raw is is the is the Shockmaster on Raw like that's that's the when they made fun of him that's not the original Shockmaster. Clip. They have a, a clip of it though in the beginning just to set it up. All right, oh, we could go with this. That, I just it's wanna, just that the audio is I a just want low. you to hear his promo yeah, now. Let's go. <laughs> so you're the man that rules the world. <laughs> Shockmaster. But you just felt you rule the world long enough, Sid Vicious. Get ready. Come on, you want a piece of me? You want a piece of me? Come and get me. Come after me, Sid. I'm ready. Along Can you pause this? <laughs> I, I, I think he has a glitter stormtrooper helmet. But it's on his chest. It's coming off. It's on his chest from when he fell and he swayed and he got that fucking stormtrooper helmet sparkles all over. I think it's coming. And why is and why is Sid all scared of him? Because he looked all scared. Why didn't he turn around and go, douchebag? Dude, you just fell through the fucking wall. The shock master is a dud, <laughs> and the promo is terrible he was and embarrassing. Supposed to be this brutal villain. 
<clears throat> this guy from another planet. Oh. Oh my god. With jeans and boots and a yeah, fur vest. Yeah, yeah. And 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 this yeah. voice the first thing you see is him falling. You want a piece of me? I just uh, fell through the wall. Oh motherfucker. Fucking hey. <laughs> that is so funny. Now what is the setup on this now? Is this from 19 just, uh, or 2009? Yeah, it was a year ago they made fun Oh, see. Much better audio. But he doesn't have his promo on this one. None other than <laughs> the Shaq Master. All right. The Shaq I told you. Oh, God. Oh, God. You, you heard someone say, what, did he fall? What did he fall? What did he fall? <laughs> did you hear that? Yeah. That low voice just says, what did he fall? That's from backstage. Yeah, that's his backstage voice. Yeah. What did he fall? <laughs> oh, I love this guy. Mm -hmm. He is none other than the Shaq Master. Right. The Shaq Master. <laughs> I told you. Oh, God. <laughs> I told you. <laughs> it's just so bad. It's everything about it is poorly done. So everything. The man that moves the oh, this is edited they from the original me. one. To the cut out some master. awkwardness. Oh, yeah. And then. One thing I noticed. Yeah, this is when they. Uh, and then Raw uh, did a spoof on it a year ago. Uh, yeah, because they were putting out what, a. When was the original Shockmaster promo? 1993. Wow. Oh, so fucking 17, almost 17 years later, Raw fucking goofed on it. That were, is hilarious. Let's see how they goofed on it. All right. No, but where's that coming from? I don't know. I think, I think it's coming from that wall. Over there. Hey, you know, it sounds like it's coming from over here. Yeah. Hmm. Very scary. Very scary. Whoa, whoa. Holy Toledo. <laughs> oh, oh, man, Jim, whoa! The Shockmaster! <laughs> Witness my awesome power! Degeneration X! I will shock you! Where's the... Where's that voice? <laughs> Where's that voice coming from? I don't know. It, uh, you know what? Sounds like it's coming from right over there. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Some guy with a mic <laughs> just standing backstage. Oh, Louis C.K. Really? Did the crowd? Did... Yeah. Did they? Anyone even get it? Do wrestling fans yeah. love the Shockmaster clip? Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. If, yeah. You, if yes. you never, it's the it's that is out of. I remember control. a lot of laughs I had. And that Shockmaster. <laughs> That's great. And then there with Dusty Rhodes, who is one, who's probably in the top five, like Mike guys of all time too. Like. It, <sighs> it, it, Dusty and Ric Flair. And Who was the that. best? Was The Rock the best Mike guy? No, not at all. Not probably not even. He might not have even been in the top five. Really? Oh, man, he was great though. Who he was, was that fantastic? Good? It was the, the Iron guys on the mic. Dusty, Ric yeah. Flair. Ric Flair is better than uh, the Rock. Roddy Piper. Um, yeah. Hi, my name five. Uh, um, God damn. I'm trying to think. That was a, but the Rock I, was good at making catchphrases. How about yeah. Sergeant Slaughter? <clears throat> no. Nah. Um, oh, uh, Jake the Snake is in, in in the top in the top five yeah. probably, and um, you know, not the, Rock is not in the top five. He's in the top ten. Stone Cold was probably better on Stone the mic Cold, than the Stone Rock. Stone Cold is, is probably that's the five. Right the Rock there. was just good at making catchphrases, and then he, <laughs> Dusty's, yeah, yeah, Dusty's yeah, yeah, the yeah. best though. Dusty and Flair are are are, are neck and neck. They're also uh, saying one. They're also one, saying two. Owen Hart had a really good one, really good blooper. Uh, well, oh, yeah, the shit. best blooper of all time. <laughs> oh, but <Jesus>. I mean, <laughs> come on! Oh, that's dude. terrible. No, 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 I'm saying uh, that damn uh, that goddamn Shockmaster dude. Oh, yeah, that's, that is that's one of the best. <clears> that is hysterical. I, I like when I'm able to laugh until like I'm actually fucking tears are coming out my eyes. You gonna try that the Owen Hart one? Funny. <laughs> I just recently stopped watching it, like and, and laughing. <laughs> yeah, but yeah. you still watch it with this thing, like wow. <laughs> he went right on his fucking head. It's his the worst thing that could have happened. The worst thing, dude. Right he, there, he, and and the helmet falling off, and he scrambles to put it on, and it's so clumsy. And then he's just standing there trying to be tough. Be tough with all the glitter on his chest. <laughs> his helmet fell off. <laughs> it's not on YouTube. I have to find the audio because I taped it off TV. The Miz, who's like a big star now, sure. One of when he was first in the WWE, they wanted to. They were using him as like a Ryan Seacrest type of host for for stuff. And like one of his first things, he couldn't remember. They were having a diva search, and he couldn't remember what number to text in and what number to call in. And he started looking at his hand for the number, and his hand started sweating. <laughs> and he just goes over, call, uh, text. Uh, it's the greatest. No, no, no skills. Let's see if the Owen Hart's good. Yeah, it's quick. 
I don't need you with a bad leg doing a Brent. You're too damn selfish, and that's why you're sitting there with a bad leg, and that's why I kicked your leg out of your leg. <laughs> <laughs> I kicked your leg out of your leg. Uh, yeah. 